Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. I hope you're all doing great. So, today I'm gonna be doing a reading on Selena Gomez. I've been wanting to do a reading on her, like, for a few weeks now. Um, I actually wanted to do an update on her life to see, um, how, th like, what things are like, what's happening, uh, in her current life. Um, I actually wanted to do a more, um, accurate reading on her professional life. Um, you know, like, I didn't do a reading on that, but you guys know that there were a lot of rumors about Selena wanting to retire. Uh, I mean, rumors. She actually said that in the Vogue magazine. But I feel like that um, Selena has still a lot of things to afford us, and it would be really, like, it would break my heart if she retires. Not now, okay? Because of haters, because of what people think, that would just break my heart. But today, I actually want to know reading, I, I, should, I actually want to do a reading on her life to see if there's anything new, if there are news. Um, what's happening with Revelacion? Is that, a, is that a success? Is it not? We shall see what Spirit wants us to know. Okay, let's, let's just get started. Okay, let me focus on Selena Gomez. And obviously, you guys, I created an Instagram page, uh, an, an Instagram account. So if you want to get private readings, just contact me there. Just slide in my DMs and uh, we can talk about it. Obviously, it's not free. But uh, if you want, I know there's a lot of people that want to get readings, but can't. Uh, so just contact me there, okay, if you want to get uh, a, a reading. Okay, so with that being said, let's, let's just get started. Okay, Selena. Okay, what's that card? Okay, what is that card? Ooh, Wheel of Fortune. Interesting. Okay, so I'm first gonna talk about only this card. This card is a major arcana. That's, that means that this is a really powerful card. This talks about a lot of things. The Wheel of Fortune basically talks about a new era, okay? Something new um, coming, okay? Like something needs to end for something else to begin. And I feel like this talks about a new era. I th I don't think Selena is going to retire soon. I feel like she's going to give us a new era. This is what this card is basically saying. I feel like she is not going to retire now. I feel like she says she has something to give us, okay? Look at that, the Wheel of Fortune. This is like a new cycle, a new beginning, a new, yeah, a new era for her. And I feel like she is, Revelacion is definitely not her last project, okay, in the music industry. I feel like some, something else is going to, is going to happen really soon. Uh, let me just look at that. What is Spirit trying to tell us? Okay, we have, oh my God, the death card. Ooh, look at that. Ooh, yeah. Ooh, yeah. Okay. There's a lot of ideas here. The first card we got was the death card. Again, this is the same idea. Something needs to end. Something needs to be dead for something else to live, for something else to begin, okay? These two cards have almost the same meaning. This is a new beginning. This is a new cycle. Something new is is coming for her. I feel like some Selena is going to give us a part of herself that we've never seen before, okay? I feel like she's going to deliver us um yeah a new selena i feel like she's gonna give us a selena that we've never seen before and i'm here for that okay i'm here for that um uh, but at the same time i feel like selena has a lot of insecurities um i feel like that selena uh has over the last couple of years lost a, a lot of confidence a lot of self-confidence um especially um you know in the ama like the ama performance like two years ago um i feel like selena lost a lot of self-confidence uh, after that show, I mean, I feel like she was not proud of herself, okay? She, obviously, she had an anxiety attack, so obviously, she couldn't control it. But, you know, people talked about it, people were laughing at her, and I feel like she was really not proud of herself, okay? And I feel like this is one of the reasons why she said um, in the Vogue interview that she felt like people didn't take her music seriously, okay? I feel like people just still see her as the Disney, as a Disney character, you know, um, which is really sad, but I feel like that Selena's not gonna give us on, 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 on us, I feel like she's not gonna give up on us, is that, is that even English, I feel like she's not give it, give us up, I'm sorry, I'm sorry, English is not my native language, so what was I saying, yes, and here we have the Justice card and the Two of Cups, um, uh, I feel like, Okay, I'm sorry. I can't help but think about Justin when I see this card. I'm trying. I'm trying to think about something else. 
Let me just think, okay. So obviously the Two of Cups basically talked about communication, talked about creating a connection with someone, okay, connecting with someone. Um, I feel like she's going to feature, okay, she's going to do a featuring. Uh, I think she's going to um, have a collab, okay, soon. Um, in the next few months, I feel like she's going to collaborate with someone. Maybe it's going to be Taylor Swift. You guys know that she posted on her Instagram a pic of her and Taylor. Um, a lot of people thought that they were going to do a collaboration together. We don't know, but there I definitely see a collaboration um, in the in her music really soon in the in the next couple of months. Yes, Ace of Cups. But I feel like yes, this is exactly what I see. Six of Swords. This is something new. I feel like S Selena is trying to. She's looking for something new. She wants changes. She wants. Um, yeah, she wants something new, okay? And I feel like she's searching for um, something new in her music. And, and this is what I was saying before. I feel like she's going to give us a new Selena, okay? A part of herself we've never seen before. Page of Cups, okay. okay. Um, now, I want to see... Uh, what I want to know is... Uh, how... Oh, wait, let me just... Okay. How is Revelacion doing? Okay. Is it a success? How does Selena think? What does Selena think about her EP? Uh, what does she think about all of this? I think it's spirit. Selena Mori how, how does she feel about Revelacion? Okay. And all its success. Think it's spirit. Think it's spirit. How does Selena Mori feel about Revelacion? Okay. One, two, three, and four. Let's see you guys. Let's see. Wow. Okay. Again, damn. Wow. Okay, what I see here. So my question was, how does Selena Gomez feel about Revelacion? Here we have the six of so. Uh, I mean, of wants, which basically talks about uh, victory, being victorious. I feel like it was a huge challenge for Selena to release a Revelacion because a. It was in, it was full in Spanish, and obviously Selena doesn't speak Spanish or only have basics, uh, but she can't speak Spanish and she's never been able to speak Spanish really fluently. So obviously it was a huge challenge for her to, to sing in Spanish, and B, she didn't know how people were going to react to this, okay? She didn't know if people were going to like it, she didn't know if her fans um, were going to like it. And she didn't know if, be, if it was going to be a success. But apparently, she's really proud of herself. Okay, look at this card. This is somebody that is really proud of himself. This is somebody that is uh, really victorious. And I feel like that Selena is, is really victorious after Revelacion. I feel like she achieved her challenge. She had, she achieved her goal. And she's really proud of herself. Um, she's really proud of Revelacion. And she liked she likes what she did, Okay. But at the same time, here we have the Five of Cups. Interesting card. This is... I feel like the thing with Selena is that... So, A, she doesn't... She, she almost didn't do any promo uh, for uh, Revelacion, which is something that really... Not bothers me, but a little. You know, I feel like if you want people to take your music seriously, you have to take your music seriously yourself first. You know what I mean? And I feel like that even Selena... Um, doesn't take her music seriously and uh, enough seriously. Um, you know, like the thing with Selena is that she's doing so many things. She's so talented. Like she's she's an actor. She's a producer. She's a singer. She's a songwriter. She is like she is doing so many things at the same time that she can't fully uh, appreciate each project. I don't know if you get what I'm saying, but I feel like that she is moving on so fast. Like, every week is a new project for Selena. Each day, like, time is work. Uh, I mean, time is money for Selena, okay? She can't... Um, she doesn't want to waste any minute. She doesn't want to waste any second. And she... Like, she's working her ass off, okay? She's working her ass off. She's always working every day on new projects. And I feel like that... Um, the problem here is that she's doing so many things that she can't appreciate each project. You know what I mean? And the thing with Reve the thing with Revelacion is that she didn't get to fully appreciate it. Um, she didn't promote it a lot. She didn't do. Um, you know, she didn't. I I don't think she's gonna perform it. Do any performance. Um, I don't think she's gonna do anything. Honestly, uh, I feel like that now. Uh, 
the the revelation era is almost done, which I'm really sad about. And I and I'm just scared it, it will do um I'm just scared it will do co damn. I'm just scared it will do like rare, you know, like after one month uh, nobody was talking about rare anymore. Like it was it was not a flop but almost, you know. Uh, and I just don't want the revelation to to be like to be like rare, you know what I mean? Um, so this is why I want Selena to promote her music, okay? It's, like, I don't know, it's obvious, right? So, you guys, let me see if there's anything else that we shall, that we should know. Thank you, Spirit, thank you, Spirit. Is there anything else? Yeah, wow, look at that. Nine of, Nine of Swords, the Judgment card, okay. Okay, Queen of Cups, this is her, the Sun card, Wow. I, yes, you guys, I don't know why I always see that. This is the end of something. There's going to be some changes in Selena's life, okay? So there, there's going to be this new era, this new cycle, this new beginning in her life that is going to bring her a lot of happiness. The Sun card is just the best card you can get from the deck. Talks about happiness, success, everything. And I feel like she's going to get over her insecurities, okay? She's going to have this revelation, this huge uh how can i say it? awaking in her life that is gonna be really um good for her okay wow good news so you guys this is all for this reading i hope you guys liked it if you did don't forget to put a thumbs up um obviously don't forget to check my instagram account if you want to get personal reading just contact me there i'll be really into i'll be really um appreciating it um there's already a few ones of you that got some readings from me and they were all super satisfied they were um, like all the readings were super accurate so if you want to get a reading just contact me there so with that being said i see you guys tomorrow at 10 a.m pacific time for a new video bye